A new version of TaskerNet is coming out soon. For now, if you want to test it, install the Tasker beta and then go into Preferences, MISC, and then Use Test Server for Shares. For shares. If you do this, you'll now use the new uh, TaskerNet beta, which is, in, which is in testing. So if you open the new website, you first get this, which is always subject to change. Don't worry, I know it's ugly. <laughs> And then, for example, if you go into public tasker projects, you get you are greeted with uh, the public tasker projects that I chose. They are mo the most important ones for users to begin with. So this, this, these are just ex examples on the test server. It will not be the final ones, but you can see there are three projects here that I can import by clicking on them. But I can also browse all of the av available projects by not filtering with any tags. But if I go on, I want to go specific, for example, I want to see projects or, or profiles or tasks related to sound, I click on this and I get two. I get a project and a profile. So let's imagine I like this one and want it, I want to import it. Click on this and you get the, a preview of the um, a description of the uh, of the profi profile, and then you have the option to preview it. You get the description and see what it does, or you can import it, and you can also directly download the XML file if you want. So let's imagine I want to import it, and this works just as before. So now, for example. I have a profile that when I choose, when I change my media volume, the ringer volume also changes automatically. You also have the your tasker shares list. I need to sign in for this. After you sign in, you get a list of all your shares, and I have a lot of them that you can then edit on the website. For example, let's see, let's say I'll, I have the public ones right here at the top. Let's say I want to edit the camera enabled one and change its description. And then I can add or remove tags. Uh, for example, let me add the sound tag here and then I can save. And if I go back to the public list, and I go to, to check it out, check out this one again, I can see that the description has been changed. And here I can also get one of my existing uh, projects, for example, edit it and make it public and edit some tags, for example, basics, then save it. And that makes it appear on the public list as well, Air gestures. So this is just a preview and a lot can change, but hopefully this will make finding tasker profiles and projects much easier in the future. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.